Good morning and thanks for joining us on the Friday edition of TVC Breakfast and what an interesting bustling week it's been and uh, here we are on uh, Friday. It's good to have you join us indeed. I am Kemi Fola Adeyemo, Sam Omashe and Mike, uh, Michael Kwoche. I don't know why Omashe always kinds kind of sticks. I, I almost gave you that surname. Uh, no, it's, it's a family so you can, <laughs> you can distribute it the, is a family. The names for now it is fine. a family. Yeah. I'll latch on to that one. Good morning. Good to see you both. Good to see welcome. You. Really welcome. Nice. Uh, well, so much on the front burner. Uh, the last yet to be heard from the uh, main opposition, the PDP. Now we hear about moves by Governor Yesom Wike to sue uh, the PDP as well as Sokoto State Governor Amino Tambuwal and the presidential candidate, Atiku Abubakar. That's an interesting development. Very. Uh, you know that uh, Wike has been, uh, how will I say, setting, setting up the stage mm. for some kind of uh, um, onslaught right. on the PDP establishment. Uh, people were saying that uh, there, was, uh, um, there were moves for reconciliation between between Wike and uh, Atiku, mm. and there was Wike's silence, uh, and then there was Wike's, uh, there was a, an Atiku, um, what they call it, interview, right. then a Wike response, and a Wike barrage, which is still going on of, uh, of um, uh, inauguration of projects. Yeah, exactly. And then uh, we saw the drama that happened, and the, the, the body language, he was talking about his enemies. He was talking about his foes, and uh, and he knew that something was coming. I, I made a remark yesterday or two days ago that it was very clear from his body language that he was going to mobilize his people against the article ticket. Now this is, uh, and then was then the two of them met. We didn't know what happened. They said they broke the eyes, and I said. Well, you can break the ice, doesn't mean the ice melts. <laughs> so apparently they still have Even glaciers. The they still have glaciers in their hearts. Yes. <laughs> so so now it has not crystallized to this. Now on the point of whether a uh, Wiki has a, a point will be determined by the judges. But people had read questions over the way the last minute moves were made. Now the lawyers are going to make their cases and so on. But it was very, it's very important to know what the rules of the PDP convention are. Mm. It's only on the basis of that that you can determine whether Wiki was... Uh, has a case uh, has or a, doesn't uh, have a case. Absolutely, yes. because that, that's even what the court would, would um, obviously want to first look but at. But, to but basically, you know establish. that this is more of a political move than a legal move. Right. Yeah. Uh, and, and of course, it's, a, it's an anything, echo to his people yeah. that me and this man yeah. will not date for the same... <laughs> which, which also, you know, makes it more interesting because, you know, only yesterday we spoke with um, one of uh, the PDP's spokesperson talking about uh, Daniel, Daniel Boala. Daniel Boala. Yeah. And, um, of course, he alluded to the fact that part of the crisis that may be rocking the party now would be resolved after the election. By that time, he said that Yoche Ayu, the party's national chairman, would mm. then, you know, vacate that position. That, but that, if, that is that is the ideal agreement that they had. Right. But even if that but, is even going to be, if we can go to the bank with that, you know, why then would you know we can still be at the stance mm. he's having? Even Bode George, the former national chairman, has also spoken that um, Mr. Yoche Ayu recall, must go. Recall, I said some time ago that in politics, there's a lot of ego. That ego is what determines the clout you have. And that clout is what paints the value that you're bringing on the table. That is what is playing out here. It's politics. The point there is, Even it, the it, it could be right that they, can, they may resolve before the election. Before it's the possible. Election, right. But the burden of resolution of this case rests on the PDP presidential candidate. <laughs> it is his baggage to carry to ensure that he stoops low to the level where Come, oh yeah, let us sit down. Let us sit down on the floor and discuss it. Because if we have to remain in our high horses, this is capable. Because, like uh, Sam has always said, uh, Wiki is a strong phenomenon. He's the party leader in the South South. He and knows the it. South South is the strong base or stronghold of the PDP right now. And, and he knows his value. He knows the value he's bringing on the table. 
And you recall that when all the candidates that we have now were going to APC, going to other parties, Wike stood, he, was, he funded the party, he was the backbone and pillar behind the party. Mm -hmm. So the point there is, as it is right now, if they make a mistake of waiting and keeping things this way until they get to the polls, I'm telling you, at the polls, it might just be, be an APC-LP affair. Right, okay. And PDP might come <laughs> a, a third or even a fourth, depending on what, because this is right. capable of distracting the whole process. All right, all right. So, so we move on now. Uh, you, you said something rather apt. It is that the government has uh, baggage to carry, yeah. and you could also add that it is baggage to, to it, manage. It's but, presently but, the leader. It's not the right, chairman of right, the party. He right. is the leader, he is a leader exactly. of right. the party, right. as it is. Right. And it's not showing great leadership by bringing everybody yeah. on board. And... You cannot ignore a person like Wiki, whether mm -hmm. you like it or not. People, people used to call Wiki, and they, they used to call him, uh, they used to call PDP Wiki Inc., mm. which means that it was actually a financial mm. backbone mm. Uh, for the party. Interesting. And, uh, Interesting. You can see that in all of this, there's also a sense of revengeism, like a sense of revenge, you mm. know, himself and Tambua. I felt like, you know, he did much for Tambua and mm. Tambua. Did not pay him back well. So this is part of that script mm -hmm. that you know, they, they, this man helped, helped him. But Tambua was looking at a more was looking at it in a more in a more how would I call it political sense, in a more clinical sense. Like right. this is not about all friendship. Right. Mm -hmm. We'll see how it all plays out. Politics, politics, <laughs> political reality. <laughs> right, right. <laughs>